Hi, this is a Python tutorial of how to insert value into access table using Python. Okay, so I'm going to run this very one, then we have a go at another one, but here are the commands that we insert to those values straight onto my database. So let's run the program. Okay, the program is, is running already. And if I open up my access database, this is it. You, as you can see, there's nothing on this table showing the value. So if I sort of like refresh, okay, let's open up view and let's go back to, there we go. You see those two records? Those are the two records we have in here. Those are the two records that we have right here. Look at it. Femi Wells and Peter Wells and there they are now okay okay let's start a new project entirely so I'm going to just go here and start a new one and that's the first thing we have to do is we have to import PYODBC and I'm going to connect to pyodbc.connect. I will now specify my driver uh, drive equals enter a coil braces and that will be Microsoft access driver and enter star there open a bracket enter star dot any file extension of access so I know of mdb comma star again dot a c c d b close the bracket and close the coily bridge bracket as well enter a comma now you must enter dbq database query equals so this is where you have to now locate wherever your database is located like i have my database in here the, this is the database i intend to use this very one so i'm going to now hold on to the shift key right click and copy part this very one they have copied the part now paste the part right here you can go to edit and just paste your part there and you can even see the name of the database close the bracket that's the name of my database okay press enter the next thing we want to do now is to do as follows Okay, right here I will now say cursor equals connect dot cursor. Open and close bracket. Now, this very same cursor, we want it to execute as follows. Cursor dot execute. Okay, now open a bracket and I will enter that then I now want to insert so let's say in here we say insert so using SQL into customer customers that's the name of my database open a bracket and let's look at the details of my database the fields look at them customer ID first name surname unit order price product name I want to enter these six columns right here so the first one is going to be customer customer underscore ID comma the other column is first name comma followed by surname and let's speed that up 
there we go now and i want to enter my my value supposing i come right down here and just say value that i want in there and that's after all my the field name one two three four five six okay the first value is going to be customer id so customer id let's say it's zero zero seven two okay enter and sign there comma enter apostrophe there i mean and the name i said the name is let's look for yeah okay let's say kinsley and sign then the next one comma the surname so name of Kinsley is Hall Kinsley Hall comma then we now want to enter unit order the unit order and I say it's ordering three of those another comma then the price right now the price of these let's say it's two 23.78 now product name let's just enter rice there and close that and that's all there is to it so all I then need to do is I can just say right here connect dot commit there we go right and one more thing right underneath here I'm going to have to enter my ampersand and just there maybe even press enter here so that you guys can see it properly there we go and one other thing is I can copy this before we run the program and enter another data in there maybe one more so we have three records in total but i will now change the names around and get back to you guys all right guys i have now inserts inserted the following okay i have three records so let me show you guys my database that's my database right there as you can see those three records are not here so when we run it okay first of all let's, let's just right click and go to design view here and when we view it we should be able to see it so let's come in here run the program oh we need to save it first okay i'm going to save it as pi customer database underscore database and click on save there all right we're running let's see we have an error okay i think i found the error okay look here right there and right there so let's correct this there and let's run our program again there we go okay the it's saying i've logged the customer table so let me close that and come here to the table and just open up the table that's the table there all right let's run it again go to file and run and see there we go i think it's working now so let's open up the table that is the table and here let me show you my three records kinsley hall peter stone jerry limestone and those three records are not here so let's refresh this so i'm going to right click on this and open it then double click on it back and there we go look at my records let's see there we have kinsley we have jerry no jerry's limestone and peter right there look at them okay so those three records are now in place 
so guys with that i'm gonna call it the end of this beautiful tutorial i suppose you guys enjoyed you all have a nice day now bye for now